Hello and welcome. This is not really a tutorial, it's just a workaround for the more adventurous amongst you that are using Unreal Engine 5.1 before its release. Maybe you don't know that much about coding, but you have been able to compile the engine and you want to use the auto setup for Unreal Engine from Real Illusion. And obviously, at the moment, this will not compile with Unreal Engine 5.1. So I'm going to show you how to do that now. With the plugin downloaded and installed, come up to plugins and let's find and browse to the folder where the files are. And obviously we are looking for this one, auto setup 1.24 for Unreal Engine 5. We need the plugins folder and here it is, RL plugin. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to do something a little bit different today and I'm going to install this to the engine. Just remember that you will need the content folder as well because inside the content folder is the CC shaders folder. Right, so again, we're going to copy the Reillusion plugin folder and I'm going to copy this over to my Unreal Engine 5.1 build. In my case, it is here and we're going to engine plugins and I will just paste it here. So now the Reillusion plugin is here. The next thing we need to do is go up to the top level folder uh, to where generate project files bat is and we're going to generate project files. This will now create the project files we need for building Unreal Engine 5.1. Right, what we can now do is simply click here to open up the solution. Um, in my case, I'm using Visual Studio 2022. Uh, you're probably using Visual Studio 2019, if you followed all the instructions uh, available out there. Uh, I use 2022 because I use it for something else as well. Okay, so obviously if we build UE5 in the normal way, let's do that now. We end up with a ton of errors because of the Reillusion plugin. It, it will not build. So the first thing I want to do is come up here to where it says F editor style is not a class or namespace. If we double click on that, it will actually open up the source file. In this case, it is CC import window dot CP. And it takes us to the first error. Here it is. What we can do is right click on this error and we can do quick actions and refractorings. And if we click on that, if it gives you a suggestion, in this case, it's asking to add, include editor, edit style, public editor style set. So let's do that. And then let's build again. And now that's complete. And what we will do is go through each one of these errors and we will try and find solutions for each thing. This is how I will approach things. I'll go through each error. I will try and build again and do it that way. As a disclaimer, in a previous life, I was a software developer. So I do understand a little bit. I, I was never a lead developer or anything, but I, I do understand how to fix some of these problems. Right, so what we're going to do, what we continue to do is go through each problem and just try and find a solution. Now, in this case, we click on, right click again, sorry, and quick actions and refractions. And there is no suggestion for this. And it's saying that this static switch parameters is not a member of F static parameter set. Now that sounds really complicated if you're not a software developer, but I can tell you that I've already been on GitHub and I've seen the changes to the code inside Unreal Engine 5. And what we need to do here is come before this static switch parameters, type editor only, and then dot. Okay. And then as we can see, it is actually here, static switch parameters. So all they've done is, is just moved where it is in, in the most basic way I can explain it. So now we have to type editor only. So now if we build again, 
we now have one build succeeded, zero failed, and seven up to date, and it's skipped none. So we now have a working Reillusion plugin. And you can do this with most plugins. Just spend a little time and, and try and figure out what is it that is preventing it from build. Sometimes they have removed features inside Unreal Engine 5.1. That happens quite often. And that may require something more complex. But when it's like this, and you can just simply move things around slightly in the code, then you can often fix problems very quickly. And since you've already got Visual Studio installed, and you already know how to build Unreal Engine 5.1, then you've already got all the tools you need in front of you. Uh, so just grab a coffee and sit down and try and figure it out. I hope that was helpful anyway. Um, for those of you that don't go down this route, don't worry, Reillusion have been great lately at providing updates. And so when 5.1 is released, I have no doubt that they will provide a fix for 5.1, a new version. So that's it. Okay, um, I'm still not doing tutorials. This was just in front of me and I had some time. And so I'm, I'm taking some time out still um, to do other things, uh, but I may return later in the year. I haven't decided yet.